Hello, this is Eve Star Malay with Eve Star Fi Fiber Arts up here in the lovely Chalet Malay. This is April 20th, 2019. Totally beautiful day. And I thought I'd catch y'all up a bit on what I've been working on. This blue set you see over here is, uh, wasn't exactly designed by it to be a set. It was two different people that designed it. It's the Living Legom Chalet on the left, and that's the uh, Celtic Cross throw underneath. That's in a color called Iced Aqua, and it's heading out in the mail tomorrow to a client in Texas, so I think she'll really enjoy those for the summer air conditioning to have a good lap in. Then up here on Yvette, we've got the almost finished uh, gorgeous purple alpaca warp that I did. The, the bottom, um, you see the fringe there is in little bundles. That's not done yet. It's just when I washed it and I crinkled the fabric, I didn't want that to tangle. So I just did a bunch of half like bow knots there. Those will get pulled out and I will either do like a macrame kind of knotted fringe treatment or just do a fairly short fringe. Maybe twisted fringe too. So I'll try a little bit of each and see which ones I like best. And that's a good all year kind of wrap for any time. It breathes really well. And here on the little rigid heddle loom I have, my small scarf loom, I've got um, the second scarf that I'm doing on this warp of half cream and half blue. And this is using the clasped weft uh, technique to try to make it look like these diamonds and triangles are floating in uh, a background of cream or a blue sky. And I'm really happy with how this is turning out. I uh, basically, as I was doing the different shapes, I was doing every other row, taking turns with the, you know, the cream and then the blue and then the cream and going one shorter or one longer warp thread to get that gradual bend there. And I'm really happy with that. I'm using a lot of my undyed uh, natural cotton here. And then a lot of these are the ones that I dyed of the same cotton. So I'm really pleased with this. There's some silk right there. Silk just glows so beautifully. And if you can't afford silk, look into mercerized cotton. It's treated uh, mercerization and it's a chemical bath they give it. And it makes the, the cotton really shiny and silky like silk. And I have a little bit of my um, hand dyed, hand spun art yarns in here. I like to do that when I'm going to change color because I like a color change to be, you know, it can be kind of abrupt, but I like to have some reason for joining that to the next section, not just leaving it hanging out there. And I might do a little bit of embroidery on this one afterwards to kind of unite all of these different designs. So that is definitely an all year scarf, perfect for summer too because everything's cotton and uh, you know, aside from the silk. So it's just a good breather and just a really fun denim but that you could dress up or dress down. So I've been excited about that. The weather changing has had such a profound effect on how I'm feeling with my joints and everything. So I hope you all feel a little bit caught up. The hummingbirds are back and uh, the woodpeckers are back. We don't have goldfinches or the indigo buntings quite yet. So they will be coming up. So thank you to our new subscribers. And uh, as you know, I have issues with, you know, uh, connectivity here in the country. It's totally worth it, but it makes it to where I sometimes upload several, uh, several short videos at once in kind of a batch. So I'll just give you the little little look see of all, everything greening up and thank you for joining me and I'll see y'all soon.